Other than that bounce, did this game feel any different to you than the first two in a lot of ways? Well, I, I, thought, we played, I thought we played much better tonight than we did the other night. Uh, yeah, it's a hell of a series. Three overtimes. Uh, yeah, so if we just get some rest tomorrow and get ready to play our next one. When you talk about, you know, um, bounces deciding games like this, the longer they go on, does it change the game, the way it's played at all? Like, are you sending more people just go to the net type of thing rather than trying to set things we're, up? We're trying to go to the net, put the puck on the net, every opportunity we get, yeah. Just to again, we talk about him every game, Dubois going hard to the net, getting a goal tonight. Just you said that he, you had no concerns about him playing in games like this, and he seems to have been everything that you've been talking about him as far as this, this stage doesn't phase him. No, no, he, play, he played well. He played both ends of the ice and, and played a really good hockey game. The guys in the locker room talked a lot about how your training camp, one of the toughest in the league, prepares them for something like this, three straight overtime games. How? how Months later, how's that lasting effect still still there, you think? Oh, I, I don't know if I, – I, I, our team's in shape. Uh, there's no question. Uh, I, I'm not sure if he can go all the way back to camp. I, I, I think sometimes your, your team's in shape when because you're getting some rest at this time of year. So, yeah, I, I, the, the first overtime, both teams, there was quite a bit of pace there. Um, yeah, I, I, to me, to me it just you're, you're running on adrenaline. Uh, to me, it's not conditioning. It's adrenaline and uh, the players that's just going over the boards and the intensity of it, I think that kicks it in. And, uh, yeah, it was a hell of a game. John, I know you can't rely on your power play every night, but did, did they make any adjustments or did you guys do anything different? No, we had some looks. Cam them? hits the post, uh, you know, on our last one. I thought we had some looks. Uh, um, we get hurt by taking two of them back-to-back. Uh, -back and. Uh, two stick infractions, and that cost us a little bit. But no, I, I thought our power play had some looks. It struggled at a couple minutes as far as entries, a couple, you know, a, a number of uh, different type injuries we struggled with. But nope, uh, I'm, I'm not going to pick apart the team. Uh, I, I think we played better tonight than we played the last game, and we won the last game. It, it's a NHL and playoff hockey. It's a strange animal. Uh, so. Uh, We'll, we'll be ready to play our next game. No one's down in our club. We're happy about how we went about a business, didn't find a way to win it tonight. Big picture in the three games together. They've had the lead at, for long stretches that the game's been tied for long stretches. You really haven't had the lead for a long stretch. Would that change the complexion of this? Has it been, I don't want to say taxing for you because I think you're comfortable there, but you have been no, chasing the player. No, I don't, I don't think so. I think we're comfortable in that. We don't want to be there, uh, but I, I don't think it's affect us as how we play. Uh, I, 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 sometimes it's tougher to have the lead. I, I felt in that third period, they were on their heels uh, in trying to protect that lead. We end up scoring. And it's probably one of our best periods uh, of the game. Uh, so it is what it is where you are at the score. Nothing, nothing affects uh, you know, you know, the effort you're putting in. in. In playoff hockey, each shift, you're going out there and doing everything you possibly can. Uh, do we want to chase the game as much as we have? No. But it, we're still right involved, and we've played three overtime games. So, uh, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll need to get some rest because it's a lot of minutes for a lot of guys. Uh, we'll leave them alone tomorrow and get going on uh, Thursday. With that thought in mind, you guys weren't down two this time because of your challenge, but how impressed have you been with your team with their ability to, to bounce back and answer and, and when, when they fall behind? Yeah, we've been doing it for quite a while. Uh, Again, you don't want to write it up that way, as I said, but uh, we talked about it. We're very comfortable in that situation right now, and uh, we just keep on playing. Uh, Bob keeps us close. Uh, uh, when we are down, he made some good saves to keep us close, and, and we find a way to, uh, uh, to tie it. I, I thought we had some really good chances in that first overtime to win it. Hit a few posts, I think three or four posts. It's the way it is, guys. Uh, we win a couple. Uh, on, you know, who, who knows where the games go. Same thing tonight. They find a way. We don't. Move by it and get ready for our next one. Can you talk about game plan on, on, the, on the challenge? Do you feel pretty confident on that one? 
that, that yes, he was going to come yeah, back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's a that's a hell of a job by my video coach, Danny. That's a great job by Danny. That, that's offside. They seem to have the run of play for a little bit, and then it, it changed when you scored the 2-2 goal, Panarin and Atkinson together. Mm -hmm. Could you feel a, a, a tilt there once you scored that goal? As far as the, a, a surge by us? Correct. Right yeah. after that was scored, it seemed like you were, you yeah. were much better. We, we, yeah, and we had some chances, you know. Uh, but you know what? We win a game in Washington where who knows how many damn chances they had against us, and Bob was that good. So it... it Hockey gods, it always comes out in the wash, and uh, so you, you move by it. Uh, I'm not upset with the team at all. We're not down. Uh, we'll, we'll leave them alone tomorrow. We have to. Uh, playing so late and, and so many minutes, and we'll get ready for our next game. It should be another hell of a game. John, I don't want you to, obviously you like to say pick these things apart, but you've had like three or four stick fouls where guys break sticks. Is that just the, the adrenaline of guys trying to make the right play and then ending up well, slashing. It's, it's, team, it's competing, but we've, we've got to be careful. Yeah, we just have to be careful because we've been notif notified before the series starts, they're going to call the stick fouls. Uh, so yeah, so we just have to be careful, but that's intensity. Okay, thanks.